Hi, fifth grade. Today we're going to um, do a lesson that involves the word palindrome. Now, I wish the word palindrome was a palindrome um, because it would be easier to explain. But these words are palindromes, and palindromes are words that are spelled the same way, forward and backward. This is noon. If you spell it backwards, it's N-O-O-N. Level, L-E-V-E-L. -E -E reverse it, same thing, civic, C-I-V-I-C. -I -I it's reversed. Race car, R-A-C-E-C-A-R. -E the two words that we're going to use today that are palindromes is mom, M-O-M, and mom flipped upside down. Wow. Remember these two words. These are all going to be the words that we're going to use today for our project. Now, you want to take a piece of white computer paper and you want to fold it in half the long way. And fold it in half again. Now, you have to have the fold right here. Get a piece of pink paper so you can see this better. You have to have the fold here on the inside with the opening on the outside, okay? So you have to have the fold here. Now, if you measure this from the fold to the end, it's five and a half inches. Let's write that down. Five and a half inches inches. Okay? Now, let's open it up and measure it all the way across. Okay, it's 11 inches all the way across. Okay? Now, we want to divide this into three equal parts. So, 11 isn't divided by 3, but 12 is. So, if we, if it was 12 inches long, we know that it would be, and divided by 3, so 12 divided by three, we know that that would be four, right? So we could have four inches, um, three sections, one, two, three, four inches long, and we would be able to have um, our three part word mom equally fit on here. So we're gonna use that number. We're going to take this ruler and we're going to measure from the fold to two. Now, from the mark across, it's like three and a half, and that'll be just fine for our purposes. And we're gonna draw a line right at the two, okay? So what we wanna do is we wanna make a, make a card that has the word mom on it, okay? Now we know that mom's a palindrome, and we also know that mom has block letters. So if we take mom, these two letters are the same. So this part here on the end, it starts with M, it ends with M. So we can make this one the M and cut two at the same time when we cut it. And the middle can be the O. Now the O is great as a block letter because all we need to do is make a rectangle here in the center, and you can see how it looks like half an O. And then this part will make a mom and a block letter. And the way you do that is you take, let me move this closer to the camera here, is you make an M in the middle, so you can see this is gonna be the leg of the M and the leg, and then make it even as a V on the top. You can see you've got a block letter there. And so that we can get some separation between the letters, I just make a little triangle to cut out at the line in the middle so that it will look You'll be able to see M-O-M -M on your card, okay? So, I'm gonna take a pair of scissors. And 
and I'm gonna cut this out, okay? You see that the one side is the M, so I'm gonna come out. I want these two to be equal. I want it to look like a block letter, so I'm cutting up here. I'm cutting it equal here. Okay, cut that part out. Cut the V at the top. Okay. Cutting a little notch here to the line, a notch here. Cutting a notch here, a notch here. And then I'm gonna cut out the rectangle that forms the opening of the block letter on the M. Okay, so when you're done here, you have a block letter M, and then you have a block letter half of an O. So when you open it up, it spells M-O-M, -M, Mom. And then if you open it this way, it says, Wow, Mom. Okay? So that's going to make a terrific card. And you can glue it like this so that it can open and go, wow, mom, this way if you want. You can do it that way. Or you can do it this way. So your mom can open it. Wow, mom. Okay? Try not to let the, um, to let the um, pencil show. But you can then color this in and you can make it more detailed. You can even add a line here so that you can see it much better. But this is a palindrome, and this is an example of cutting the letters so that it's symmetrical on both sides. I hope you enjoy your project. Bye.